Hello everyone, today in this video we will fight against the Atmos character of our world around us and this time we will uh, try to discuss the issue of collaborators and collaborationists. What I understand are under these two terms. Collaborator, according to the revolution given by French, uh, sorry, a definition given, given by French historians, collaborator is a person who co decided to collaborate with German occupational forces uh, during Second World War because of the uh, practical and tactical reasons as exactly during his trial Marshal Petain said that he decided to collaborate with Germany in form of a Vichy government uh, to uh, make French people avoid the cruel fate of the Poles in the Second World War. We can like it or not, but uh, one thing is certain that sufferings of French people were largely reduced thanks to the existence of the Vichy state and for uh, more than two years, two years and few months, Southern Zone was actually free zone uh, that was a state in alliance, of, in alliance with the Third Reich, so National Socialistic Germany. And uh, these were collaborators, but collaborationists were people who, due to the ideological reasons, their own personal convictions, decided to join uh, German armed forces or to collaborate with German administration for the reasons that they really believed in the ideology and propaganda spread by Nazi Germany and they wanted to build as they were saying, a common Europe of nations under German leadership. Okay, so we can just evaluate it differently, but we need to remember that this division between collaborationists and collaborators really exists everywhere. And in my country, we also have now people who support patriotic forces and people who support so-called progressive uh, leftist forces that support uh, four countries that are having huge influence on my country. The, out of these four countries, two countries are the main opponents for ages uh, and the main, I would say, exp uh, <laughs> explorators of Polish nation and Polish land, I mean Germany and Russia. And I can tell you that from the uh, moral st uh, standpoint, Collaboration and collaborationist movements are difficult to defend, but from one side, uh, from practical side, uh, like in France during war, I understand collaborators to reduce losses and suffering of France and French nation. Collaborationists, uh, from one side, I can even respect them, even if sometimes I don't agree with uh, some form of being collaborationist with some regimes, but they were following their own convictions and they bear, bear the consequences. So we can respect that. They were uh, loyal to their own views. But in uh, peaceful times, if you are a collaborationist, like in Poland now with leftist forces, because you believe in this ideological bullshit, you are simply stupid and there is no excuse for it. But if you are a collaborator, uh, opportunist for the material uh, benefits, if you collaborate with, and in many countries as well who are in such situation in Central and Eastern Europe, if you, I would say, if you collaborate with uh, such forces that are practically economically and, ideolo and ideologically occupying your country, and you do it for the profits, like for better job, better salary, and so on, you are worse in, in peace, peaceful times as a collaborator than collaborationist. Because collaborationist can be always excuse. I believed, I really was thinking that it's a good path, I was stupid and so on. Of course, it doesn't repair the bad stuff they did, but we can excuse them in these terms. But collaborators in, peace, in peaceful times are the worst options. This is how I see it. All the best. Have a nice day. Bye.